Mm-hmm. Are the origins of speech? Yes. Mm. You know, uh, as I understand it, uh, language is something that the family doesn't really appreciate. Yes. Now I'm conscious of reign in linguistics was so supreme. Mm. Reduced other linguistics to filling in gaps and supplying footnotes for Noam Chomsky. Yeah. Um, you know, uh, this acronym family? Yeah. Mm-hmm. The A E I O U. Oh. Mm-hmm. The top secret family? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Where uh, words don't mean what they are spelled to mean? Yeah. They have some other meaning? Yes. You know, there's a possibility that you have been uh, dogged. Yes. Mm-hmm. Now, somebody said that we are going to virtualize the educational system of the United States. Yeah. And we are all going to read our memories as if doing our homework was just a memory. Yep. Yeah. And then uh, through that virtualization, mm-hmm. we were going to remove all known speech because linguistics is absolutely unnecessary. Mm. Now, I think that talking is very important, yeah. and that the words that are used have the meaning of what is being said. <laughs> now, I'll give you an example. Mm-hmm. Let's say, yes, Marilyn, mm-hmm. sitting there cross-legged in bed with her back against the wall, yes. watching television without any clothes on. Yes. I walk in, mm-hmm. I'm in the top secret family. Yes. She sees me eating a bag of Cheetos. <laughs> now, the top secret family yeah. mm-hmm, would say he's eating Cheetos. Yes. See the high of the I.I. cross of the United Nations sex. <laughs> now, Marilyn doesn't know that I've been fantasizing about having sex with other women. <laughs> Now, this idea, yeah, chili, yes, Mm -hmm. Lay's potato chips, yes, (laughs) Fritos, somebody introduced all of us, yes, to being top secret agents in a top secret family. That use various products that are, oh, look at you, Miss Purple, <laughs> oh, which I know. <laughs> you know, um, I am thinking, yes, that I'd like to go back to the uh, language, yes, and the normal smell, yes, of being people. <laughs> now, um, I just wanted to know, do you eat your thoughts? <laughs> I mean, it's one thing to eat yourself on somebody, yes. But are you really eating yourself on so that you can smell their pheromones? Are you taking their nose? Yes. So as to throw what looks like your sexual experiences. Mm -hmm. But it could have been what you were smelling. Oh, I just seen your anus. How did that show up?